How to Create a Curtain Wall and Section Window. In this chapter, we will show you how to create a unique contour plane curtain wall in the section window. Activate the first preset view located in the Chapter 11 folder. Select and open Section 1. After selecting the section marker, click the right mouse button and select the open section from the context menu. You can see three different 2D polylines in the section window. Press Fit in Window if you can't see all of them. Activate the next preset view. and select the CW9 favorite. We will draw a curtain wall based on this polygon. Select the chained polyline geometry method. Draw the reference plane around the polygon. Click outside with the sun cursor to set the external side. You will get the place curtain wall on section palette. Select the fourth positioning icon and enter 10,000 millimeters for the length, then press place. Activate the next preset view to see the curtain wall in 3D. We will now cover one of the ends using the section window. Activate the next preset view. Choose the boundary method. Draw around the curtain wall. Click outside of the polygon with the sun cursor. Activate the next preset view to see the model. We will now create a tube curtain wall using the circle in the section window. Activate the next preset view. and select the CW10 favorite. Select the center point and radius curved geometry method on the info box. Hover your cursor over the circle and the center point of the circle will appear. Click on the center of the circle and draw the reference plane. Click outside of the circle with the sun cursor. Keep the same positioning method as before, but now enter 20,000 millimeters for the length, and then press Place. Activate the next preset view to see what the tube curtain wall looks like in 3D. Now let's create a shell-shaped curtain wall. Activate the next preset view. and select the CW11 favorite. Select the chained polyline geometry method. We'll use the magic wand. Space click on the polyline to quickly draw the reference plane. Click over the shell with the sun cursor to define the external side. Select the third icon from the left from the palette and enter 10,000 millimeters, then press Place. Activate the next preset view to see it in 3D. We will place metal junctions on this shell. Select the curtain wall. Switch to the edit mode. Click on the system settings on the menu. Select the junctions from the left part of the palette. Choose the junction 12 type. Select the curtain wall system and select the place junctions at all grid points and click OK. Exit the curtain wall editing menu. Activate the next preset view to zoom in 3D to the junctions. Activate the next preset view to switch to the floor plan. As you can see, there are three curtain walls on the floor plan as well. Activate the last preset view to see the three curtain walls in the 3D view. This completes Chapter 11.
This function will be a great help for users designing special glass surfaces. You can use the section window for special and precise curtain wall shapes.